someone who, who goes from one country to another country because of insecurity, because of poverty, just because you move from one country because you want a better life for yourself and for your family and you want to create opportunity in order for you to be safe and your family to be safe, that doesn't make you a bad person or a bad family. It doesn't matter who you are. My name is Sohel Ahmed. I am an uh, Afghan British professional boxer who came to this country at the age of 12 as a refugee kid. One hell of a journey. It was literally, you know, we took all means of transport walking, train, car, lorry, you can imagine, right? Five months it took us to get to the UK. The time where I finally made it through was when the guy opened something and then he said, oh, I can see English signs. And he says, oh my God, we are in the UK. That was the happiest moment. I was like, yes, finally I'm here. No more traveling, no more cold nights, no more hungry nights. Refugees are looked at a, like a bad thing in the society now, especially in the Western world. Uh, they think of refugees as you are a scavenger. I don't agree with that at all. I think, yes, everyone at a certain point needs a little bit of help to start something. Kids could be cruel. I used to get bullied in school because I couldn't speak the language. I couldn't fit in. And when I got beaten up a few times, I said, it's time for me to learn how to fight. You know, and then I got into sports. I got into Taekwondo. I initially started it just for self-defense, to be honest with you. I didn't, I didn't think I would have a career in it. And then, you know, that Taekwondo, I won the British Championship. I won bronze in the European Championship for Great Britain. I started boxing at the age of 19, which is quite late for someone to start boxing. I set myself a target. By age of 24, 25, I need to be a professional boxer. And I just started training, training, training. I was training with professionals at that time. And in the meantime, I used to go to work in the weekends. I used to earn money to support my mom and dad, you know? I had a lot on my, on my plate. I've had 16 professional fights. I'm going to fight for big titles in this year, in the beginning of next year. My whole aim since I left my country, my family, was to be successful. That is the main thing. If you're successful, you know, and you're happy what you do and who you are, and that, that is enough. I think you've achieved the main things that you need in life. That's the main recipe for a good life. People from all over the world, like, they, they are fighting in their country, so they have no Re they have no choice but to go somewhere where it's safe for them to create an opportunity for themselves to create a better future for their family, for their kids, and for the next generation. That doesn't make me a criminal. It doesn't make me a bad thing. You just, yeah, call me a refugee all you want. I've achieved more things in this country, in my life that I've spent in 21 years in this country than most men that are 50, 60 year old. Does that make me a bad person? You do the comparison.